What's up guys, this is a video of my first subscriber session. They wanted to play some Search and Destroy. I never really played a lot of Search and Destroy, but that's what they wanted to play, so I figured I'd mix it up and play a little bit of that. I started off this gameplay not even really knowing what to do, but you'll see at the end, I kind of get the hang of it and a little surprise at the end. But I figured this would be a good time to let you guys know how I make videos and how you can make videos for free. I didn't want to buy an HD PVR right away, although I am planning on getting it because I do enjoy doing this, but at first I just wanted to see if I liked making videos, if I liked commentating, if anybody actually cared to watch my stuff or if you guys thought I was weird. So I figured I'd go out there. I got a lot of love from you guys and my subscribers and stuff, so I figured, hey, I got to make a go at this. Um, but what I do is I, uh, I, I make the gameplay, and while I'm making the gameplay, I have a set of turtle beaches, so this is um, this is an optional thing. If you want to do live commentary, you're going to need something like that or some kind of mic to record while you play. Um, but if you do have a set of turtle beaches, you can plug in the power supply into a laptop or a computer, and then you can plug the pink wire into your computer, and then you can run a program called Audacity that'll just record. And then you can run your green wire into your speakers as your TV or your Xbox or whatever as you normally do. And then what you do is you can actually hear the game just like you, you know, you're playing normally, but when you're speaking, it's being recorded in the TV or on your laptop. So therefore, you can actually do live commentary while playing for really cheap. All you need is a computer and some turtle beaches. The program I use, like I said, it's called Audacity. It's just a recording software program. Um, it allows you to record and clip and cut and edit. If like, I say something stupid, I just kind of cut it out or something. Um, so you can do that, and then what you'll do is, this only really works for Modern Warfare 3, or uh, maybe Black Ops, I don't know, I never really tried it there, but um, what you do is, if you had a gameplay that you liked, and you commentated and you liked it, or if you just, you know, you want to commentate it later or whatever, for, I'm actually commentating this game after the fact, so uh, a lot of my commentaries are live, this one's not, I just was playing with some subscribers, with some subscribers, like I said. So, uh, what you want to do is you want to put your video in your vault, whatever one that you like, and you can render that video, and this is also depending on what system you have. If you have the, the Premium Elite, you have 60 seconds where you can render a video to YouTube. If you don't, I believe it's 30 seconds. So you have to figure out what you have there. But um, So I cut up my videos, and I literally just watch it and hit the record button for 60 seconds. Uh, I, I go to about 58, 57, something like that, and I just stop the recording. Then I put that little that little thing, I'll name it like just 1 or 1A one or something, and I'll put it in its own little vault slot. And then I'll go back to the video, it'll, it'll leave you right where you were, where you left off, and I'll just rewind just a little bit. And then I'll record, and then I'll unpause it and let it play. And uh, what it does, why you do it like that is because if you just record at the beginning, there's this real like chirpy sound, it's really irritating, so you can cut that out. Um, so you just rewind it a little bit and record and you just want a little bit of an overlap on your video so you can kind of cut and you can kind of get the frames really well. Um, you can see in my videos they kind of, they don't always sync perfectly but I try to do as best I can. Um, but then you pretty much cut them all up into segments and then you render them onto YouTube and then I use a program called KeepVid. Actually, it's not a program, I'm sorry, it's a website, just called KeepVid. And you just put in the YouTube URL and you can download the program to your computer. And then once I download it to my computer, what I do from there is you can use, I just use Windows Movie Maker, you can use whatever you want really. But uh, I kind of clip it together. So I download all those clips and then I clip them all together and like sync up the frames and everything and I get one long video. Now it, it's a long process and it's a little bit, um, it's just, it's a little bit time consuming. So that's why sometimes it takes me a little bit to put some videos up. And it's not true, true HD. I mean, you can kind of see the quality of my videos. That's what you're going to get. Uh, HD, yes, but it's not like an HD PVR. So that's that's an also downfall. So, But it's for free. So, I mean, if you like to try this stuff and you just want to say, hey, well, maybe I want to try out some videos, make some videos. This is how you do it. So you clip them all together, and then you just add your audio that you've edited and that you like with Audacity. You just add that into Windows Movie Maker, and then you can export it or I believe it's save video as or whatever. And then you can just upload that. You just made yourself a video right there for free. Free way to check it out. I actually am planning on getting an HD PVR soon, hopefully soon. And uh, so you should see the quality of my videos going up and it's gonna cut out a lot of that legwork, some of those hours. I mean, the process of cutting and pasting and putting those videos together is probably gonna take you just to get to the point where you have your recorded video ready to be synced up with your audio. I mean, you're talking three hours, but um, Hey, if that's what you like to do, I put a lot of work into these videos. I really appreciate it. if you guys like the videos, favorite videos, subscribe, let me know what you think of them. But I put a lot of work into these things, so uh, if you guys like it, please let me know. Alright, peace.